Asante, where are we going? Where do we go? <laughs> Not that you had to think about it. <laughs> We're here at Left Field and we are meeting Christina. This is her birthday weekend. Well, yeah. Happy birthday! And uh, we're heading to Puerto Rico to do our normal. Have fun. Is okay, that money got long. Ain't on my soul that fed my hunger. Short little flame, yelling my name. Gear packs done, drove me insane. Gang. Where? Puerto Rico. No. Yeah. No, we're going to Tampa first, no. and then Puerto Rico. Yeah, that's what we're doing. She doesn't know where we're going. Too early. And then we have Christina. We found her. <laughs> 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 so we're heading out and I'm so excited. I'm gonna show you a fit check a little bit later. You're gonna love my outfit. Perfect for traveling. Be me for more tips. <laughs> Airport trend call here. Backpack by Love Nook, Amazon, sweater, New York and Company, good vibes, lots of candy, boutique. <laughs> Leggings, athletics, <laughs> and wait, hold on. Flip flops, Walmart. <laughs> Follow me for more. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all don't know how excited I am. So we're here to pick up the rental car. And we're riding in it. You know how much I love Jeeps. Let me show you. It's my color. I love silver and black. So excited. Only bad part is I don't get to drive this thing. I'm not on it. Sante's bedroom. Super cute. The closet. Now we're across from the bathroom. Just a regular bathroom. This is Christina's room.
come outside. Got your sitting area. Grill, little drink area, and then our cute little pool. Bowl. So, this is our place. Love it, love it. If you're looking for a place in Puerto Rico, this Airbnb is nice. It's got three bedrooms, two baths, two sitting areas, a nice little kitchen. It's a great area where you don't feel like you're in a bad area. So serendipity, I think it's a great spot and I think you would definitely love to come out here and visit. So if you're looking for a place, check us out. Check me out or who's going and I could book it for you. But see you later. We're at the Serendipity in Puerto Rico. Two tears, we're out. Next, we got up early and headed on over to Cafe Serrano. Cafe Serrano was a really cute, quaint coffee shop. Um, it was kind of a hidden gem. We didn't even know that there would be a coffee shop here, but thanks to maps it led us here and we were pleasantly surprised as you can see the AC worked extremely well because it was cold in there however the food was great here are a few coffee options if you kind of don't understand how to order um, here are some of the cute little coffees that were brought to our table and cheers Next comes the food and everything is delicious. That dish right here with the steak is my favorite, but everything was equally as good. Here is the brewery, or I'm not sure what it's called when you have like a coffee bean factory or something like that, which was in a warehouse right next to what we were, where we were eating. Um, after coffee, we headed over to Catalina Beach. And this was a public beach and we had an awesome time. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Be careful, Christina. So we are at um, we're at North, I think North Carolina Beach. Um, we had to pay five dollars to get in here and pretend like we were going to go eat just yeah. to get on the beach because the beach is closed on mondays and tuesdays i don't know why but it works in our favor because but nobody's here. yeah nobody's here so it's great it's empty it's quiet no loud music no loud people no kids Ooh, well, that's cool. yeah no kids so we're about to get some sun get crispy see you in a little bit Next on the list was the Bayo Bay Tour in Fajardo, Puerto Rico. This was something on our bucket list um, that we all wanted to do. This is where you um, kayak through all of these trees and unfortunately we couldn't show this part because it was so dark we could barely see. Um, but you kayak through lots of trees into open water and you can see the glitter in the water, the little plankton glowing in the water. Here are a few shots of us laughing and uh, just showing what a good time we're having with our weak arms because we did have to paddle pretty far. And Nicole, girl, I'm not a gondola driver. As you can see, the reason that we did not see the luminescence is because of this beautiful full moon. 
Next up, we took a ferry over to Vieques Island and we rented go a golf cart. I think it was a four by four golf cart. And look at us go. We found this beautiful, secluded, private beach. Um, the water was so beautiful. Um, the uh, Look how clear, I don't even have words. Look how clear this is. It's like paradise. I'll just let you take it in. I mean, it doesn't get any better than this. Even the sea bead is whipping its hair back and forth. So beautiful. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Whoa, look at this crab. All this beaching has made us hungry. Now it's time to eat. Look at this cute little place that we found on Vieques Island. I wish I could pronounce the name Rincón del Sabor. Sorry if that does not sound correct, but it was delicious. Unfortunately, we were so hungry we didn't get to take any pictures. So this beach we were looking up on the map and it was supposed to be a black sand beach. Unfortunately, it was not black sand, but uh, this thing is following me. Okay, he finally turned around. Look at the horses. These are wild horses just walking around the island. It looks like Nicole was photoshopped in this photo, but that's real. As we were riding through the town, there were also wild horses just walking around. This guy isn't wild, but he was sure fun to look at. Peace out. Thank you, Vieques. You owe us nothing. This is like an old coral reef.
let's take a tour to Old San Juan. What you see in front of you is called La Perla. So this is a popular place with visitors. Um, it's a beachfront property. We did not go there. However, we did walk through Old San Juan, taking in all of the beautiful scenery. The, a lot of the roads were cobblestone, um, lots of hills. So bring your walking shoes and be prepared to step, get your steps in. A lot of the buildings were colorful, historic, just it's such a beautiful seaside place, extremely breathtaking. Um, we walked and saw lots of uh, shops. This picture is a picture from the Menudo album and we wanted to recreate. Also, we saw the Umbrella Alley, which was the pink butterflies. And now it is time to turn up. We did not need any chips. We were all salsa. This is our first time at a salsa club and we thoroughly enjoyed ourselves. I was kind of green. Well, all the way green. Nicole did a great job though. She fit right in. Look at you go.